Hello everyone, and welcome to my channel, in this video I explain, how to convert a drive from FAT32 to NTFS, without data loss, and I confirm that you can do this, without any data loss, as good as the NTFS format is, most external hard drives, and thumb drives are by default formatted in FAT32, if FAT32 restricts you from adding large files, or setting permissions, you can convert FAT32 to NTFS in Windows, without data loss. NTFS is pretty feature rich and supports large hard drives, bigger files, lets you set file permissions, and has better data security, that is one reason why Windows often recommends, and defaults to formatting a drive in NTFS format. This is the drive that I want to convert to NTFS, with the data inside, as you can see. First, in the search box, type command prompt. Open command prompt result, and select run as administrator. Write this command, convert drive letter slash fs, and tfs, you must replace, drive letter, with the letter of the actual drive you want to convert. The command must be written correctly, with changing the drive you want to convert me. Then press enter to execute the command, after that, it asks you to write the name of the drive, and you can find out the name of the drive by going to the drive and knowing its name. For example, the name of the drive that I want to convert is new volume, know it and write it as it is inside the command. Type the drive name and press enter to execute the command. The conversion process will start, depending on the size of the drive, and the amount of data in it. The entire conversion process will take some time. At that time, do not close the command prompt window or turn off the device in any way. Once the conversion is complete, you will see the conversion complete message. At this point, the job is done, and you can safely close the command prompt window. Go to the drive and right click on the mouse, and select properties, and look at the file system. You will find that the drive has been successfully converted to NTFS. The conversion was also done, without losing any data. Be careful during the conversion process, and you must know the letter of the drive you want to convert, and also the name of the drive, so as not to make any mistakes. I hope the video is useful to you, thank you for watching, and I hope subscribe to my channel, thank you all.